While we should all strive to eat a healthier diet, it can be hard to figure out how to do so. Should you eat more grains? Should you cut out dairy? What about sugar? What about fat? The paleo diet is based on foods that our ancient ancestors ate during an era called Paleolithic era, hence the name paleo diet, the caveman diet, or the hunter-gatherer diet. Although it's impossible to know exactly what our ancestors ate in different parts of the world, researchers believe their diets consisted of whole unprocessed food. By following this type of diet and leading physically active lives, hunter-gatherers presumably had much lower rates of our lifestyle diseases, such as obesity, diabetes, and heart diseases. Several studies suggest that this diet can lead to significant weight loss without calorie counting and major improvements in health. In one study, 14 healthy medical students followed a Paleolithic diet for three weeks. The participants lost weight and slightly reduced their waist circumference and systolic blood pressure. In another study, participants follow Paleo diet for three months, and these are the results. 1. They lost 6.6 .6 pounds and lost 1.6 inches more off their waistlines, compared with the diabetes diet. 2. Hemoglobin A1c, this measure of 3-month blood sugar levels, which decreased by 0.4%. 3. HDL, which is the good cholesterol, rose by 3 mg per dc liter. 4. Triglycerides, which is the bad cholesterol, its levels fell by 35 mg per dc liter. So, what foods to eat on the paleo diet? There's a variety of whole unprocessed foods you can eat on the paleo diet. This includes the following. 1. Meat. Includes beef, lamb, chicken, turkey, pork, and others. 2. All types of fish and seafood. 3. Eggs. May be free-range, pastured, or omega-3 enriched. 4. All vegetables and fruits. 5. Tubers. Like potatoes, sweet potatoes, yams, turnips, etc. 6. Nuts and seeds. Like almonds, macadamia nuts, walnuts, hazelnuts, sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds, and more. 7. Healthy fats and oils includes extra virgin olive oil, avocado oil, and others. 8. Salt and spices like sea salt, garlic, turmeric, rosemary, etc. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe to our channel and activate the notification bell. Now, what about foods to avoid on the paleo diet? The paleo diet discourages consumption of certain foods, including 1. Sugar and high fructose corn syrup includes soft drinks, fruit juices, table sugar, candy, pastries, ice cream, and many others. 2. All types of grains and legumes. 3. Most dairy, especially low-fat dairy. 4. Some vegetable oils includes soybean oil, sunflower oil, cottonseed oil, corn oil, and others. 5. Artificial sweeteners, like aspartame and sucralose. 6. Highly processed foods, everything labeled diet or low-fat or that has many additives, including artificial meal replacements. A simple guideline for the paleo diet is, if it looks like it was made in a factory, don't eat it. Now let's talk about modified paleo diets. Over the past few years, the paleo community has evolved quite a bit, as a result of the exclusion of several food groups that are highly nutritious, including grains, legumes, and dairy. For example, legumes are rich in fiber, protein, and a variety of micronutrients including iron, zinc, and copper while dairy products have essential nutrients like calcium. So, there are now several different versions of the paleo diet. Some of them allow a few more modern foods, such as gluten-free grains, like rice and grass-fed butter. Today, many people think of paleo as a template to base your diet on, not necessarily a strict set of rules that you must follow. Here is a sample paleo menu for one week. Pause to get it all. And by all means, adjust this menu based on your own preferences. And here is some paleo snacks. Thanks for watching. See you in another video.